T.J. Tyne and Tyne near side goes across for Nick Hag, fires and scores. Hag, the defenseman, jumping up right wing circle, lets it go. He's been picking up goals left and right for the Wolves. That'll now be his sixth goal in his last seven games. And overall this year, tally number nine for him. He gives Chicago a one to nothing lead with 9.20 to go. Here in period. Some pressure, walks to the middle, wrist shot, and a blocker saved by Legasse. Standing in front of him, Jacob Nielsen. Blocker over to the far boards, and Ruda has it for the Hogs. To the goal line for Jordan Schrader. Back to Ruda. Ruda centers it up for Nielsen. A one-timer broken up. Nielsen again. Scores! First time wouldn't go through. Schrader goes right back to Nielsen on the inside of the left circle. Power play goal for the Ice Hogs. And we are tied up at one with 7.02 to go in the first. Fly out to center, and Carlson will... Roll back inside the Ice Hogs zone. Anton Forsberg performing admirably for the Ice Hogs in that first period. 12 Saints on 13 shots. Max Legasse, 5 of 6 in the opening frame. Ice Hogs throw it towards the front of the net. Yoni Tula, pardon me. Alexander Fortan lets that one bank off of skates. It goes off a member of the Wolves and right past Legasse. Fortan had it at the right circle and just sent it over. And it Alexander Fortan from William Peltier. They're going to give a second assist to Lucas Carlson on the play. They give the Ice Hogs a 2-1 lead. Fortan, left circle, fires, hat save, rebound, scores! Fortan again! He got it going from the left circle, bounces around the crease, and Alexander Fortan. Two quick goals to begin the second period. And the Hogs make it 3-1 with it immediately and out to center ice comes Dylan Coglin. Coglin leading the rush into the zone, drops it off, wrist shot, they score. McKenzie from the deep slot goes upstairs on Anton Forsberg and the Hogs see their lead go down to one as McKenzie right down the middle of the ice gets it on a pass from just off that far circle and in one swift movement Gets the half wall, in comes Carr, a little two-on-two -two battle as Blake Hillman in a good shoving match. His deep partner and Carlson in with them. Now in comes Schrader, digs it free, but the Wolves get it back out to the blue one, fires. Pat save, Forsberg, rebound, they score! Daniel Carr takes it around the goal crease, and Anton Forsberg goes left to right, could not go back across the way as Carr swings it around him, and we are tied up at three with 5.49 to go. Hit the outside of the cage. He had plenty to battle through and could not get a clean shot away. Tyler Sekiro, right wing boards. He'll take a shot, but that one easily blocked down. And Daniel Carr will pick it up. Carr to Gage Quinney, fires and scores. Quinney ties things up with 126 to go in the third. He beats Forsberg low to the stick side from a distance out. This one, high in the air and out to center. Schrader with it, kicks it on to Jacob Nielsen. Nielsen back into the offensive zone. Down the right wing, needs some support. Holds up to the blue line for Carlson. Great move, walks to the middle, fires and scores! Lucas Carlson, magnificent effort, cuts to the middle of the ice, and the Hogs take a 4-3 lead with 3.21 to go in the third. Jacob Nielsen holds up at the right circle. Hit the outside of the cage. He had plenty to battle through and could not get a clean shot away. Tyler Sekiro, right wing boards. He'll take a shot, but that one easily blocked down. And Daniel Carr will pick it up. Carr to Gage Quinney, fires and scores. Quinney ties things up with 126 to go in the third. He beats Forsberg low to the stick side from a distance out. Give it back over to Rockford. Jacob Nielsen with 47 seconds left. Nielsen left side. He's got Anthony Lewis two on two, but Lewis frees up a lane left wing. Lewis back door, fires, scores! Darren Radish on the one-timer from Anthony Lewis. The Rockford Ice Hogs in overtime defeat the Wolves five to four. Anthony Lewis faked as if he was gonna go to the middle. 